Well, welcome back to another episode of Hard and Uncut. So you find me on the pause screen again. I must resume my flight. We're just uh, coming down from our rendezvous, which I think was possibly the worst rendezvous ever because they, they weren't really sort of... The requirement was that our two vessels be sort of near each other. Um, hmm, it says that that's finished. Has it actually given us the... Has it given us that? Perform a rendezvous maneuver. It says we've done it. And explore curve and says we've done it. So is the mission complete? Because it's sort of showing a little rendezvous two vessels, but yet yeah, it's saying it's done. That's interesting. Well, I suppose we'll find out once we land. Um, yeah, that, that's interesting. And he's just going to return, I guess, and, and do all of his stuff. Right. Um, yeah. Why is that not ticked? Rendezvous two vessels in orbit of Kerbin. Uh, right. Let's recover the vessel. Recover the vessel. Thank you. Right. So, yeah. Um, I don't think it was a very good rendezvous. I don't think our speeds were close enough. I would like to get them down to zero. We weren't using RCS, but you know, I, my major concern was the the electric charge we had on the vehicle and whether um oh there we go and whether we complete some more contracts. So we can just get this off here, get this off there. Oh, Mac Macfen Kerman has now got some tourist levels. I don't even know how that works. Do, do they become better tourists? Uh, ferry to tourist destination. Okay, done that. Okay, so let's just check. Oh, that's done. Okay. We've still got that science to collect from around Kerbin, but let's have a look what it's done to our thank you. Explore Minmus. Ooh. In the grand scheme of things, we know very little about Minmus. Well, well you're absolutely right. We don't know much about Minmus. Um, drug shoot on flight. I don't really want to do that. Ant engine over Kerbin. Decoupler and suborbit. I think we're going to, we have to take the Minmus one, don't we? Which gets us close to having more funds for stuff. So, so what's our next, our next goal? I really want to get EVAs. That'd be one thing I'd really want. And I think going to Minmus will get us enough money to do that. But I really need this as well. If I if I want to go into planetary or anything like that, we're going to need this. Uh, have we got any science to... Sp we couldn't. I mean, we, we, we're one science off being able to buy one of these, which would get us two crew capsule there. It would get us some bits for planes, potentially. And it would also get me clamps, which would be useful, and struts. And it would get the Mark One cabin, which holds how many people? Two people. Which does give us a potential for a little cheap orbital craft. I know somebody somebody in Discord actually suggested something like that. And I think that's, pro or actually in comments below as well. Uh, so that would be something to look at. So maybe that's what we'll go for. If these, if these sort of contracts for orbit around the moon. Uh, that's one, one, two orbits around the moon. You're a orbit of Kerbin. You're a fly by the moon. Uh, what have you? You got a satellite in polar orbit of the moon. Ooh, that's uh, interesting. That is a possibility, but I don't really have communications to do it. VIP suborbital and orbital. We could keep doing those because those are going to rack in one, two, uh, let's say two, three, four, five. Say about five, fifteen thousand. How much does our how much does our orbital rocket cost us? Is the first question we've got to ask ourselves. Orbital rocket costs us a little black screen. Thank you very much. Uh, oh, it's interesting. That's probably because I paused it. Right. This thing costs us eight. So we could actually make a profit out of it. Just sending them up uh, and doing orbits. And although I think some of them are suborbits. So, yeah. Um, so we'd be making 50% back on these. And we could just knock those out. But I don't really want to force you to watch that. Um, so I think... Oh, it's a good question. What do I want to do? Do I want to go and try and land at Minmus? Do I want to go to Minmus? Um, what question for you all? What things do I need for us to start getting missions which are rescue missions? That's the interesting one. I wonder if I need docking ports or something like that. Advanced flight control, flight control. Where's where's docking ports? Uh, are you there? No, that's robotics. Actuators, that's grabbers. Um, propulsion. Where are docking ports? That's a good question. If you know where the docking ports are, please tell me. Aerodynamics. Specialized construction. That's a, the clam that's the clampertron port, but it's that's the, the big one. Where we're well, not the big one, the medium one. Where's the small one? Clampitrons, clampitrons. Have they changed the design so I just can't see them? Um, are they somewhere else? Am I looking in the wrong place? Is it that they've moved them? Where would they possibly be? So that's that. That's there's the airlock. 
and then you should have the big ones around here somewhere they down here so that's the clampertron senior and all the other stuff so clampertron senior is there we've got this thing here we've got the airlock there we have the standard one there so is there a smaller one further forward that i'm just missing i will have to have a look see if there's a, a link somewhere or something to a to something to try and tell me so if anybody wants to tell me where the actual small docking port is oh is it miniaturization it is so that's the one i want to do my first dockings with right okay so we need that if we're going to keep going so that's going to be our next aim, I think, because that also gives us EVA. So if we go for getting the astronaut complex upgraded um, and then going for um, that science, the 90 science, because the other thing is that we're actually getting to the point where we're going to need to upgrade this to go any higher than the 90 band. But we've got a lot of stuff to go on in there. So we, we need that um, and all this stuff is fine. So I think we're going to go to Minmouth. So let's go check out a Minmus potential craft. I wonder what we will use. Maybe we'll just use like the Mun craft. I might I'll tell you what we'll do. Where's Mun 3? Because we know Mun 3 is a nice craft. We'll take Mun 3. We'll call this uh, Min 1. That's, that's, a, that's a capital, a capital I that we don't need. So it's Min 1. Right. Do I, do I want to take, oh, first of all, do I have solar panels? Yes, I do. We're going to have that. Thank you very much. We're going to stick two of you on the front. Here we are, just there. One of, no, I need two of you. Uh, in fact, I'm going to put them on the side. In fact, I'd really like to bring them back, but we, uh, how much are they? Oh, they're cheap, it's fine. We'll have two of them, just one there and one there. That's good. Right, now, <clears throat> I'm now over my part count because of my legs. So we're going to get rid of the legs. That's that fixed. I've got one part left. Um, do I still have a battery inside this? Yeah, I do. So what I want to do is get rid of the battery. That gives me two parts. Okay. Um, that's two parts. Is two parts enough? Is two parts enough? That's a good question. Um, yeah, I think it is. I think we'll just go... I, I don't have a transmitter. That's the big problem. So I can't transmit anything back. Um, so, but that's fine. I don't mind about that. Um, so we're going to put some science on. We're going to put one of you. Yeah, one of you and one of you. And I'd really like to get you in Minmus's sphere of influence. Now, the irony is that if, um, if this vessel was actually um if this vessel was actually weight limited i would have actually taken these biological capsules off and i'd have put more of these things on but because we're part limited um and i'm aware of that i'm happier to put the bigger things in i'm actually tempted if we had eva i would be putting the, the science junior in it would be here right now and we'd be popping out and getting in fact we potentially would have two of them um if i'm real if i'm being honest get rid of that uh keep the jetpack just in case because i wonder how far off am i i'm three thousand off so actually doing the flyby would get it um i don't think upgrading i don't think they get the skill until they return but maybe they will um let's save that for a uh mid one overwrite Yes, I want to overwrite min one. Thank you, Rach. Um, let's leave the jetpack on for now because uh, we'll see if there's anything interesting occur. So let's get this thing saved. Next time we're going to launch this, but actually um, we, we have somebody we have to bring back down. I've just remembered we actually have somebody in orbit. Um, we can't dock to him because he doesn't have a docking port. So uh, oh, um, also we're going to... No, we're going to leave... We're going to leave... Uh, that one there we're going to leave the cheaty probe out there because that's actually already saved us in the last uh, in the last mission wasn't it so there um so next episode we will go to minmus with that craft we'll set the flight off as soon as we are, are, are starting the episode uh, this thing we're going to turn around right now how much fuel have we got we've got loads of fuel so we're going to do a uh, actually you know what's our 
Okay, we've got loads of electric charge. I wonder. Where's the KSC? It's there. So let's warp to here. We're going to bring him down near to the KSC, I think. Or, or nearish to the KSC. I could actually kill most of the velocity. Pretty much dead on. And we could just slam down to him. Um, what's his altitude? He's at 84, so he's going to hit atmosphere reasonably quickly. So let's go to here. Um, there we go. That's fine. Right. We're now gonna we're gonna we're gonna put this craft into a really precarious situation where we're just gonna burn all of the fuel. There we go. Right. Fire that. Fire everything. Fire it all. Thank you very much. And I want to pull down to about there. I think. Yeah, that's probably too much actually. Um, right. Let's uh, fast forward a bit. We're coming over the mountains. We should come down nearby. It'd be really nice if we came down near the KSC, is what I'm thinking. Um, there we go. Um, do I want to do a bit more burning? I am traveling at pace right now. You know what? Yeah, we're going to do a bit more burning. We're going to slow ourselves down just a smidgen. Um, it's half the distance until we're about there. Uh, about there. Yeah, that's where I want my, my point of impact to be. So about there. Ish. Ish. I'm about 35 times. So about there. About there. About there. There we go. That's fine. Put us on surface mode. Um, actually, we're over the mountains right now. I could just keep... Let's just go a bit more. And then we'll just fire all the engine. All the engine when we're over the, over the mountains. Yeah, there we go. That's it. Fire everything. Fire absolutely everything. There we go. Get it on. We've got three minutes to get down. I'm not I'm not too worried about this. Right. Come on. Go down, 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 down. Right, and then we're going to decouple. And fall. And we're going to land in the sea just beside the KSC. That should be where we are. Isn't that wonderful? Right, how are we doing? Oh, it's actually already armed. That's interesting. So I've obviously, my staging has messed up a bit. So that's why these are going up. So this was actually on the same stage as the decoupler, which is obviously what's been throwing us up in the past, which is interesting. So we're going to just splash down there. The reason for doing this, primarily just because I could, and you get a tiny little bit more in the way of funding uh, of your money back when you actually land near the KSC. So that's that's the re whole reason. There, there's the... the the body. If I was really clever, I'd have actually taken us back. I know I should have thought about that. We were in line for it as well, weren't we? We we're slightly on an odd orbit. You see, our our time that we've gone around the planet, we weren't perfectly equatorial, so we're now slightly out. Um, as the planet has uh, rotated, it's sort of yeah underneath us. Um, right, and then we're down. Good stuff. You, Sen Senok worst. Senok worst. See, I can I can see it now. Senok worst. Right, recover you get that done we've got about a minute and 40 left so i can actually have a little a pause for once a little relax a little think about the next thing so we're going to send that mission to minmus so that's ready to go we just need to put a crew member in let's see we've got no science for anything uh, we should have got a mission completed for science though we've got a monoprop back you get nothing for that you get something for a blater okay so blater must cost you as well then otherwise it's silly you've got jetpack cost us money we got back Oh, what do we get? We're ninety-seven point six percent. So, you know, we we got a we got a thousand back, which isn't bad actually. And oh, ah, because we finished missions and we got stuff back, and you are now a level one engineer. I'm not entirely sure if that's ever any use to us whatsoever. Oh, we got that. So we have now got some funding. Okay, so get that closed. Is there any other stuff that I can actually do? Uh, test a Rover Max model S two at the launch site. Ooh, I'm going to take that. How long have I got to do it? I've got a year to do it. Uh, it's just a box. I just need to basically set test on it. So that's not a problem. Um, that gives us a bit more funding. Polar orbit of the moon. Drug shoot, destination, destination, decoupler, liquid fuel engine, decoupler flight over Kerbin. Uh, that's a big one, is it? I can't remember. That's quite a, a speed at 900. You'd probably want to be doing that going up, I'm guessing. Yeah, you'd want to do that going up and then just uh, fire it off. And that's not going to give you a master mount. But anyway, so next time we're going to launch for Minmus. 
we have this task it must be completed um, so from me until then I can hear the alarms about to go off have a great one